Hi everyone, welcome to week six. This is your final session with me, so I hope you enjoy it. We'll be doing some new activities today, but mix it up with stuff that you already know. So, first things first, we're gonna be doing our warm up to get ourselves nice and warm. You'll be doing an activity we've done before called Pirate Ship, and I'll quickly go through what it was again. So when I say main deck, you're gonna be marching on the spot. You can bring that up to jogging if you'd like to increase the pace. When I say scrub the deck, you're gonna get down low and pretend to scrub the deck. When I say watch the beam, you're gonna duck down lots of low. Okay, so if you can get down lower this time, it's even better. When I say walk the plank, you're gonna try and walk in a straight line with your arms out and you can see if you can go backwards as well. Okay, are we ready? Off we go. So main deck, off we go. Might add some new activities in this time. Scrub the deck, let's get that nice and low. Main deck. Scrub the deck. Main deck. Well done. Watch the beam. Main deck. Well done, keep going. Can we increase it to a jog? Let's get this heart pumping. Watch the beam. Main deck. Keep going. Walk the plank. Well done. Main deck. Well done. Keep going. Scrub the deck. Main deck. Now when I say north, you're going to come forward. When I say south, you're going to go backwards. When I say east, you're going to go this way. And when I say west, you're going to go this way. Okay, are we ready? North. East. South. West. Keep going. Main deck. Back we go. So we do know it now. Ready? Well done. Scrub the floor. Well done. Main deck. Walk the plank. Well done. North. South. Well done. Main deck. Watch the beam. Main deck. Watch the beam. Main deck. Well done. And well done, guys. Warm up done. Last warm up done with me, guys. Well done. So in this time, we'll be doing activities. So start off, we're going to get on the floor. Okay, so get into yourself a nice space on the floor. In this one, we're going to be doing, going onto our knees. Okay, so make sure I've got lots of space. And we'll be going from our, like a press-up position, but on our knees. And what we'll be doing is going from our hands to our elbows to our hands. Okay? So you can mix it up so you can go right, left, left, right. We need to make sure we alternate it and do it at different times so we work all of the muscle groups. So we'll be doing this for 45 seconds. I want you to be doing it at quite a slow pace, okay? Because this is a new exercise for you guys. We'll be working different muscle groups here. So let's give it a go. Are we ready? Okay, Kofi. Off we go. So we're really engaging our upper body here. We're also going to be looking at our stomach muscles. It's going to be keeping us nice and tight. Okay. Shake it nice and slow. So you should be really feeling it. You can make sure all your weight is onto your knees as well. So it's sharing the weight so it's not all onto your upper body. Keep going. Well done. Brilliant, guys. Well done at home, keep going. Last 10 seconds. Well done. Good job. Well done, keep your arms a rest, shake around. Brilliant job. Give a shake. Okay, whilst you're resting, I'll show you the next exercise. So, I'll show you from the side. Back a bit so you can see me. Okay, so we're gonna have our hands, our knees bent, and our hands on our legs. Okay, so you guys will have your hands on the floor, and you can either touch your toes or touch the back of your heels. Okay, or you're gonna be seeing if you could just move your hands from your wet, from your thighs to your knees and back again. Okay, so nice and slowly as you do that. So, are we ready? Put the timer on. 
Pokey. Off we go. So I'm going to just do it, see if I can mix it up. I might do half and half. So make sure our head is facing the ceiling as we're doing this. Even if we're doing the toe touches, we're in a bit of a crunch position. Head face the ceiling, go from side to side. You can mix it up if you want. You should be feeling your abs, I certainly can. Well done guys. Last 10 seconds, well done. Nice and slow. Brilliant job, keep going. Brilliant. Oh wow, my stomach must have hurt on that one. Well done guys. Ooh, give yourselves a big stretch. That stomach must have a stretch. Okay, so we're going to get our heart rate going again now because we've been sitting on the floor doing those exercises. So we're going to do our star jumps. Now it can be your proper full star jump. So jumping out, arms up, turn back again. Or we can do our half jacks, whatever you prefer. Okay, so let's give it a go with the full jumping jacks today. And see how far you get. So, are we ready? Off we go. Good job, keep going. If you're getting tired, you can bring it back down to a, a half jack. Really pushing it out though. Let's get this heart rate pumping. Let's keep going. If you can join back in again, that's brilliant. Keep going. Well done. Last 10 seconds. Keep going. Brilliant, well done. And well done, guys. You should be getting your heart rate back up on that one. So, the next exercise, so last one of this set, we're gonna be going to a squat position and doing chest press okay so from the side we're going to be tempted to sit on the toilet or your chair okay and as we come up we're touching the ceiling go down touch the ceiling so we're bending our elbows and doing a chest press at the side time so let's have a look from the front so bending our knees and our elbows and as we come up we're doing a chest press okay or a shoulder press sorry and a shoulder press. So as you can see, my feet and knees are all facing the same way, and I'm my knees are not going over my feet. So let's give it a go, guys. Last exercise for this one. Are we ready? Off we go. Well done. Good. You don't have to be going as low as me. Just a slight bend in the knees, perfect. Or if you really want to challenge yourself, you can go down lower. Okay, but really try to push that thing above your head. If you've got a heavy box above your head, you're pushing it up. Okay. Keep going. Well done. Brilliant. Well done. Keep going. Fab job. Well done. Last five seconds. You can slow it down if you want. Perfect. Well done guys, give yourself a rest. We've got a minute rest, so I'll explain the next ones whilst you're doing that. Let me just, really, let's get some music on. Okay, so give your arms and legs a bit of a shake. Brilliant. Okay, so, we're gonna be back on the floor for the first section, so get yourself, you can rest while I'm explaining. So, we've done it before, we did it as teddy bear, I think you might remember. So, bending our knees and sitting upright, and I just want you to slightly go back a little bit, so you're not 100% standing upright, you're just slightly leaning back, so I'll just do it from the side. So instead of like this, I just want you in this position, okay? And we're gonna be going from side to side to side, okay? So your feet will be on the floor at this time, and you'll be going from side to side to side. Are we ready? Nice and slow for me. Off we go. You can really stretch up if you want. Stretch up and bring down. 
but this is really working your core here. With you slightly leaning back, you're having to engage your tummy muscles in this activity. So keep going. Well done. You can slow it right down. Brilliant. Can you touch your elbow to the floor as you do it? Can you touch your elbow to the floor? Keep really stretching that bit. Can you really twist round? Perfect, guys. Well done. Okie dokie. We're going to be doing a kneeling superman. How weird does that sound? So, what you're going to be doing is you're going to be on your knees, hands in front. Oh, okay hands in front and you will be rotating what leg you do okay so switch it so first of all you'd be lifting up your left leg so it's nice and straight you can see it behind me and at the same time you're going to try and lift up your right arm just for a second and then bring it back down and lift the other legs really back down and you're just going to be doing this for a few see if you can hold it for a second if you wobble that's fine you can see me wobbling that's absolutely fine. We're going to say, if you just want to be, if you can only just lift your leg off the floor and just lift your arm off the floor, that is absolutely fine. That's perfect as well. So let's give it a go, guys. Let's see what we can do. Are we ready for the kneeling Superman? Off we go. All women. Well done. Keep going. Really think about your breathing. You can probably hear me really concentrating on my breathing here it helps with your balance okay so if I'm looking at the floor it's because I'm trying to keep balance so feel free if you're not looking at the screen you just want to you know what you're doing take it nice and slow though guys you're doing really good well done let's switch over again brilliant guys this is really really working your balance and your stability your core, everything, this activity lasts two, one. Well done, guys, that was fantastic. Really, really hard, you can hear I'm out of breath from just doing that, well done. Okay, let's get our heart rate going again, even though I'm sure we we're all pumped. Are we ready? So this one, we're gonna be doing a jog and a jab, okay? So really pick it up, you can either do a heel, heel flicks, or really pick them up at the front, whatever you prefer, okay? And at the same time, we're going to be jabbing forwards, okay? Really, really pushing forwards. Are we ready? Off we go. Keep going. Let's get this heart rate up. This is the last two exercises. Come on, guys, you can do it. Last session, last few exercises. Keep going. Well done, really punching through. Brilliant, guys, well done. If it's really getting tiring, you can bring it back down to a march. As you're marching, you can be jabbing, so like this. Okay, but keep going if you can. Last 15 seconds, keep going. Brilliant, well done. Last two, one, woo! Let's get our breath back. Fantastic guys, so in this last exercise, well done, we're going to be doing a thing called a curtsy lunge, so I will explain it. So we're going to be doing it on different legs, so we've done a lunge before where we step back in a straight line and we bend our knees and come up. This time we're going to do a slight curtsy, so when we step back we're going to go slightly behind at an angle like this and bend our knee. That's if we're doing a curtsy. We'll bring it back, change direction. Okay. Nice and slow as we're doing it. Because we haven't done this exercise before, so we want to make sure we do it right. So as we bend our knees, we don't want to make sure our, our front knee is not going over our foot. And we come back up and change legs. Okay. Are we ready? Last exercise, guys. Off we go. You can have your hands out for stability. I have a bit of a wobble on my leg. That's my weaker leg. 
So even just a slight bend, guys, could be working new muscles that you haven't used for a long time. Well done. Ooh, you can work out which is my stronger leg. Bring it, guys. Last 10 seconds. Keep breathing. It's really important to keep breathing, not hold your breath through these. Last one. Woo! Well done, guys. Last exercise done. So we're back onto our challenges. So get a drink, get have a rest for a second whilst I'll explain. So last week we did the wall sit, okay? And this time we will be doing that again for 30 seconds. I want you to challenge yourself to see if you can get a bit lower this time. If you didn't do the whole 30 seconds last time, can you do it for longer this time? Okay, so it's your challenge to see what you can do. I'm gonna see if I can get a bit lower on the wall and we'll see how we get on, okay? So it's 30 seconds, so get a drink. Okay, give your arms and legs a shake because they've been working hard. Okay, so find your flat surface, your wall. Get yourself ready, so back against the wall, facing forward. How low are we gonna go? So I think I was this last week. So I'm gonna see if I can get a bit lower, okay? So making sure my knees are not over the top of my feet. They're in line with them, okay? Head facing forward. Are we ready, guys? 30 seconds on the clock. Off we go. Let's see if I can get better a bit lower. Oh, I can feel it. Should be feeling it along your thighs here. Look, it looks like I've, you should have a chair underneath me. Well done, guys. Keep going. Last one. We've got one more challenge after this, and then it's a cool down, and you finish your six weeks. Fantastic. Last three seconds. Come on, we can do it. Can you get down a bit lower? Two, one. Well done, guys. Did you manage to beat last week's scores? So whether that was for, to hold it longer, or if you got lower, or just doing it again is a fantastic job. Well done, guys. So this week's challenge is going to be a type of plank, okay? But we're going to be doing it on our knees. Okay, so like we've been doing some of the other exercises, and you're going to be on your, you can either choose, you can be on your hands, like this, so your feet can be up or down. Okay, down flat on the floor. And you can be like this, or you can be on your elbows. Okay. And you're going to see if you can hold it for as long as you can, okay. So, we're going to put the timer on for 30 seconds. But if you can do it for 5 seconds, if you can do it for 10 if you want to, if you find you want to try both of them out, if you want to try it from your hands and it's getting hurt, hurting, you can go down to your elbows, okay? But make sure you're on your knees. If you have your knees, your feet down, it's a little bit easier. If you have your feet up, it's a bit harder, okay? Let's give it a go, guys. Last exercise. Off we go. So I'm going to go onto my hands, I think, for this one. My feet are up, giving myself a little bit more of a challenge. So making sure my weight is on my knees and over my hands front, okay? So my hands are above my shoulders. So we are halfway, guys. Can you do it a bit for a bit longer? You should be starting to feel it in your shoulders, maybe. Really holding your tummy muscles. Really pull on them. Gives you a bit of support. Last four seconds. Come on. Three, two, one. Well done. Let's stretch it back. Okay, so let's go back onto our knees. Well done. Fantastic, guys. So let's do our cool down because you've been working lots of new muscle groups this week. So we're going to do our arms first, okay? So arm across, reaching after the elbow and look in the other direction. Well done. Let's hold it there. We've been doing lots of new arm muscles today, so let's keep going. Brilliant. Give them a shake. Let's change it over. Well done. Brilliant, well done. Okay, triceps, hand behind, other hand on the elbow, and just push it on its own. So you should start to feel it down this side. Well done. Brilliant, 
change it over. Right, we're going to just really stretch up, okay, today, because we've been really working our abs. So we're going to just lean over to one side, come back to centre, over to the other side. Well done. Whew, keep your arms in that shape. Right, onto our legs. We're going to stretch this muscle here, our quads, okay, so our hip, knee behind. Hold it on if you need to, and just pushing your hips slightly forward. Well done. Brilliant, guys. You should really be feeling that you can catch your breath again. You should hear it in my voice. You can actually hear me not breathing, so well done. You've really got me getting going these last few weeks, guys. Thank you very much for your help. So hand on your bent knee, we're going to be stretching the back of our leg, the straight leg. Well done. Changing over. Give your legs and arms a shake. Well done, guys. Thank you so much for being with me the last six weeks. It's been a pleasure. I wish you all the best and Maybe see you again soon. Take care.